I grew up in Russia, and uh, when I was five years old, I saw Maya Plisetska, who's like one of the great mm. Russian dancers, ballerinas. She like danced into her 80s. She's just wow. was one of my heroes. Mm. But I saw her when I was five, and she was dancing in this um, Swan Lake, and she was doing the Black Swan. And when I looked up at that stage, I mean, there was no woman. It was just this black swan on the stage and I was mesmerized and to me that kind of transformative experience you know because not only was it that her dancing was so um, superb but it was also her ability to just completely get lost in this animal and so that's when I I, I mean Ska, definitely my like, passion for dance mm. developed even a little earlier because I, I was a rhythmic gymnast and I started training when I was three oh, wow. yeah um, but uh, but yeah acting was always you know, as a dancer, it was like, because I've danced for so long, mm. I, and I definitely had an insecurity with acting and certainly being an immigrant, you know, coming here mm. at 11. I didn't start learning English till I was 12. On the stage, and I was mesmer- So, uh, so I would, for years, I was definitely more comfortable telling stories so, mm. um, from my body, superb, you know, but it was musicals also and stuff like that that I did in high school. But I think acting was always kind of in the back of my brain mm. and... Um, yeah, and because and I actually got into LaGuardia High School for dance, mm. and it was around the time, you know, being an immigrant, I felt like I had to give back to my family, mm. and I couldn't come home and say, hey, guys, like, I'm going to be a dancer now, you know? <laughs> so I, I, I decided and I definitely to, like, had an insecurity real. with my life, and I actually went to NYU, and uh, I was studied... Was it like going to NYU back then? Yeah. English till I was <laughs> back then? Back then? Oh, yeah, yeah. That time no, ago. no, I mean, back then in your life, that. like, that period of your I, life. I mean, it was great. I was, I was on a path. I was like, I'm going to... You know, I was studying economics and double majoring in psychology. I think acting was going to rule Wall Street and had all these grand plans, but really all I was doing was just... Yeah, and, you know, I, I, I could imagine yeah. myself doing all these things. I, I, I had so many things you know, I wanted to do, but, but really I just wanted like to act. I had to get I always back. took acting class in school, even in NYU. And, hey, guys, like, you know, we said, like, oh, I'm just kind of here, mm. you know. And then I graduated early, and I had about a year and, uh, at NYU. And, and I remember like, having, like, a really serious moment with myself on the stage. stage. And I was messing No, 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 I mean, back then you were like, you know, if I'm on my deathbed... Like with my grandkids, like I mean, part of the actor's imagination. <laughs> I was like, "What is the thing that I'm gonna regret kind of in not doing these like, grand you know, plans?" Like what, but really, if they asked me, like, "Grandma, do you have any regrets?" Like, what's what would be the one for thing? Dance, and and, and for me, it was really acting, and you know, and I also had to ask myself, like, if it wasn't for family responsibility, if it wasn't for security, if it wasn't for um, financial security, like, what would the thing that I would, you know, and then I graduated, because there, there's a lot of pressure as an immigrant, you know, having to, like, to make NYU you, do something and, real and mm. um, you know, so I gave my diploma to my mom, and I said, thank you down, so and I asked myself, me here, like, and I'm going to go know, if I'm on my school, and I'm going to see how it goes, it was a two-year program, I, uh, the William Esper program, and I was like, I'll go for three months, if I don't have kind it, of in the, or if I'm not into it, I can always leave and go back to my life, and regret two like, years went by, what would be the one thing, I and loved it, and, for, and then I got invited back for a master class with Bill for six like months, it wasn't for, and I remember even at the time, looking at the other actors, just thinking like, you guys are the real um, actors, I'm financial, kind of, even still, yeah, like after school, I was like, you're gonna go get agents, you're gonna get managers, I don't know what that's like, make it, I, I'm, very, I'm a very nervous person, and I would get really nervous, like being in front of my mom, and I said, thank you, down, speaking. and I asked myself, and, like, and um, so yeah, but then like within a month, I had representation, it was a two-year program, and I, then, uh, I remember sitting down with them, and I was like, guys, I'm gonna need a year mm-hmm. of auditioning kind of because them. I'm so nervous. I just need to get comfortable back to my life. And they and were like, sure, whatever regrets, you like, need. What's, and what would uh, be the one? two months later, I got my first job, and uh, I've been really, really fortunate that since then I've just worked. You know. Mm-hmm.